Hello, Nat here. Let's take a look at what's been making news. During the COVID-19 pandemic, lots of people have been working really hard to keep us all safe. So some kids from Victoria decided it was time to say thanks. They've started something called the Thank You Project Australia, and you can get involved too. Hi, BTN. My name is Grace, Harry and George, and we're the creators of Thank You Project Australia. Thank You Project Australia is all about giving kids the opportunity to thank the essential workers who have worked so hard to keep them safe during COVID times. It's a kindness project that everyone can join in. Thank you, Shadfield Cottage. We started by delivering letters to the local butcher, doctors and pharmacists. And then Mum posted a picture on social media and lots of people wanted to join in. In four months, over 50,000 thank you letters have been delivered. Thank you, Master and Family. Thank you, Thank you. Our goal is to get every primary school student in Australia to just write one thank you letter. There are 2.13 million students. That means 2.13 million thank you letters. And therefore, 2.13 million happy people. The thing that I like most is giving thank you letters to the local councillor, premier and prime minister on behalf of Thank You Project Australia. Thank you so much to all of the schools and teachers who have already joined in and help turn our little idea into a big idea. Thank you, we really appreciate it. Territorians went to the polls over the weekend and now we've finally got a result. The Northern Territory's Labor Party will be returning to government, led by Michael Gunner. Not all the votes are counted yet, but Labor's claimed the 13 seats it needs to form a majority government. An 11-year-old from Gaza has been making waves after a video of him rapping out the front of his school went viral, earning him millions of views and thousands of fans. Here's Charlotte. Have you ever been Move over, Eminem. Step aside, Kanye. There's a new kid on the block, and he has some serious swag. Can't none of y'all mirror me, babe? Cause in the way I'ma let you stop it for cause of mine. What I say, I'ma do so, I'ma do it. I give a damn what you think. Meet 11-year-old MCA Abdul from Gaza, who's been getting a lot of attention lately for spitting some pretty sick rhymes. I memorized it, I started to rap it, and then I figure out that I'm talented about it. So ever since then, I was uh, writing my own original songs, and then I was memorizing new cover songs, and uh, things is going well right now. Abdul mainly raps about war and hardship growing up in Gaza, a territory people have been fighting over for decades. My message talks about peace. I want to convey it to the largest number of people and I want to show, you know, I want to show how is the life in Gaza to outside. MCA Abdul's dream is to one day tour America as a professional rapper, just like his favourite artist Eminem. I would like to be like Eminem, like I didn't say I want to copy his style, I said that I hold my that I have my own style, but he's my favorite rapper. He's my idol. So watch this space. Now, before we go, here's something that's sure to make dogs and their owners feel proud as pooch. <laughs> On the shores of Monty's Beach in Croatia, people and their pets have been gearing up for an event like no other: the fourth annual Croatian Underdog Marathon. Oh, and they're off. That nearly caught me off guard. Among them, big dogs, little dogs, and other dogs of other sizes that aren't particularly of note. All 24 entrants in this dogathlon have to complete a gruelling and varied course. But it's not just a running competition. No, it's also a swimming competition. I see some of us have opted for floaties. On the other side, a finish line awaits. And first to cross the line is Nimbus with his human owner, Marin. Well done, Nimbus, but also well done, everyone. Even you, floaty dog. The whole purpose of the Dogathlon is to get people and their pets to bond with each other and to make new friends. Now, I'd say that's the real prize here. And dog treats. Well, that's all the news we've got for you today, but don't worry, we'll be back again tomorrow. In the meantime, hit subscribe and like. Go on, do me a favour.